Come and say good morning. Good morning, my little girl. I think mum booked me in for it, um, a little haircut with Daniela, my stylist. <laughs> oh no. Damn machine. Where are you dad? Are you looking? Are you looking for your dad? Girl, those chairs are still there, Mazzy. My brother in law's like, don't worry, I'll take them, I'll take them. Girl, mommy's angry. So you guys saw yesterday that I was talking to Genji in over in LA and um, you heard me say in that vlog that I'm coming over next week. That is true. So officially my dates for my US trip is I'm leaving Sydney on the 11th of November, Saturday the 11th and I'm returning on Saturday the 18th. So it's one full week. Jen and I were like really excited about that. I'm really trying to just do so much with her. <laughs> I'm like, you don't need to work, girl. Hopefully, hopefully a meet up, a meet and greet in um, Fashion Files Beverly Hills boutique location. So hopefully, and I will get back to you on all of this. Like I will, when we've nutted it all out, I will let you know. And hopefully we, when I go down to San Diego, we're hopefully doing a meetup in the Carlsbad Fashion File headquarters there as well. So hopefully two meetups. If you want to come, that would be amazing. When I definitely have confirmation of the dates and the times, we do, we are working out um, that the times for the meetup will kind of be late afternoon, like four to six or five to six kind of thing just because i know people work during the day and maybe they can get off early and just come and say hi and have like a coffee or a champagne or something like that when i do confirm it with fashion file team i will have a submission form because they just will want to get a head count and if you don't you're not sure you can just still fill it out and just be on the list do you know what i mean it's better to be on the list i suppose then they're not, even if you don't know if you'll be available to come. So, yes, that is my information on my trip because so many people are asking. Okay, so a quick Q&A with you guys from yesterday's vlog. I still want to keep up Q&As in my daily vlogs. I feel like they are so interactive with you guys. I get to answer any questions. I really love questions. Um, so if you have any luxury questions, please ask me questions because I also love keeping that my content. So obviously I'm going to address Miss KW Shops is the first um, comment that came up <laughs> this morning and it's a huge one. Um, she's a little worried that I'm not going to keep my regular content and she's not she's not a fan of vlogging and that's not a problem at all babe I totally understand some people love vlogs they love to see everyday life and some people love to see a really structured you know sit down YouTube video whether it's hauls or reviews however what I am going to say is some youtubers create a vlogging channel and then keep their regular channel. I can't stand two channels. I've said this before, I will never have two channels. I can't stand tracking and keeping between two channels, like just not. I can definitely tell you, babe, I am not stopping my regular content of sit down videos. I used to do two to three sit down videos a week if, if I could. Um, I'm definitely going to be able to do properly especially after my trip, one to two a week with daily vlogging. So that is a lot. Like, it is a lot of work. Okay, firsts today, Lisa Gomez first. She's asking me, first, love the vlog. Yes, Lisa, you are first. Hi, babe. 
and uh, Brita79 says yay for vlogs these are all sort of the first top four that come in hey first hey Priscilla Priscilla BB hi babe from Argentina hi Argentina <laughs> Laura writes yay second that's so cute from Leeds from Leeds England hi doll Nadia writes I think I might actually be first <laughs> so close it must just be so close like if you type and comment type and comment like everyone yeah totally hey girl oh my gosh Laura Baker says hi Jerusha hi Laura nothing has me more hype than opening YouTube and seeing your videos oh thanks I'm so glad I'm so glad favor to divine yay thanks for vlogging watching from the Bahamas Oh, Nicola, she put her name. Hi, babe. Hi, Nicola. Thank you from the Bahamas. This is a really cool question. Alexandra. Hi, Alexandra Marie from Sydney. Hey, babe. Uh, she's from South Sydney. Go to our cafe down in San Susie, Machina. It's so yummy. Um, she actually asked me a luxury question. She wants to display her luxury goods. She wants to display them in a glass cabinet. It's in a room with a window that's frequently got, frequently leave with the blinds open during the day. Should you be worried? Okay, so my studio is where all my luxury items are and I have complete blackout blinds in there. I definitely suggest to keep your blinds shut, babe, if you're gonna keep your items in there, just to preserve them. And last comment, this comes from Jen Elizabeth. Hi, Jen. She says, greetings from San Diego. Nice. California, please let your subbies know how we can meet you. You are my favorite YouTuber. Oh my gosh, that's so lovely, Jen. Thank you. She just picked up her first classic Chanel flap. Medium caviar leather with silver hardware. Die from Fashion File yesterday. Eh, eh. Oh my gosh. Oh, fantastic, Jen. Oh, I hope to meet you so much when I get down to Carlsbad. You're pretty scary. You're pretty scary. What? Your t-shirt says raw and you have a tail. <laughs> I think so. I think so. Did Nana get you that scary t-shirt with a tail? I'm so scared Now we are good. Yummy. Do you love your tomatoes? Push. Massey did a drawing for Nana. Come on, Massey, you're wearing a converse. Come on, Massey, Nana's in a rush. You're getting a haircut. Daniela, um, my hairstylist, fit him in to have a haircut. So, how cute. I had to put him in his Connie's, Mum, because I don't have any other shoes. Quick, put in Nana's car. Go in there. I had to put him in his converse. Hi. I had no other shoes. Okay. I rang Daniela. She knows you're coming down now. Hello, are you here, are you? No. Because it looks fabulous. I just cancelled the appointment. They're booked Beautiful. out till Christmas. Okay. Yeah. Mum is so amazing. She said to me yesterday, you know, how can I help before you go overseas to prepare and everything? What, you know, what can I do? And I said best thing you could you do for me is when you take Mussy in the afternoons like late afternoon around four just till till bedtime and then I can come down to your apartment and pick him up and she was like yep that's no worries so she's so amazing so she comes and picks him up now and I can just nut out everything I'm doing and not sort of have to entertain him or like whatever so but he's such a good kid so it's not that much it's not a lot of entertaining but it's really good I'm starting to get lists done and plans 
But now we have to go to the shops and uh, buy a proper like check-in black suitcase because my husband gave our two <laughs> to his parents who are traveling back around all around the Middle East and everything. So I'm like, great, I have to go get one. So you saw me just trade out. Look who is the riding in the passenger seat with me. I did once, once upon a time, get a question about sizes of boys. So this is the old medium size. I know that Chanel like don't stand by any of these names that I suppose get made up, but this was like the original medium size. And then there's the small, which is about that much, that big and it's so cute oh my god i'd love a small and the new medium is a lot bigger yes you can fit more but i find it like the proportions are a little bit boxy for me so um i really prefer this size if you are in the market for a boy Jules is not answering. What are all these people standing here for? What, has something happened? It's like all these people. Will be something I don't want Sorry, to shush babes. Why are they all standing? Can I go? Can I move? Oh my lord. Okay, I'm going to say. Parking lots are the worst. The worst. My car got, for sure, got smashed in a parking lot. Enter Quincy Barking. We're doing dinner. No. I think it is. No, it's beautiful curly. And when it's like this, it's just floppy but in control and the back's just at the oh back. Oh no. Isn't it? Oh my goodness. Oh. oh. What? What are you telling me? I can't bring it. How do you look? Hi. How are you? How what a frantic week. Yeah, she sold two houses. Oh my god. The farm in Brisbane. Um, sold two houses. So it's been a really busy week, but a great week and a productive week. And we're on countdown for this girl. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I'll see you tomorrow, guys. Bye. Bye.